me more soldiers, noble leader, that they may sheathe their swords in the beating hearts of our enemies! Our men need better weapons, Lord. Let us put the scroll heads to work on this worthy pursuit. That is for his excellency to decide, Visigoth. A noble leader, there are matters other than this blunted spear point to attend to. Give me better ships, your excellency, and watch the seas turn red with blood! We need barracks, noble leader. Or would you have our soldiers sleeping on your palace steps? Would you defend our cities with haystacks, noble leader? Build city walls first and other improvements later. All is well, your excellency, and that pleases me mightily. <laughs> We stand astride the world like a colossus, noble leader. Send forth our legions so that we may smash every army that would rise against us! Excellency, let us sharpen our diplomacy first, and our swords later. Your Excellency, the torch of knowledge sputters in your hands. Excellency, I have calculated the science rate out to the third bead of my abacus. And I am dismayed by what I see. Your Lordship, who cares about brains if the people are happy? Don't lower your luxury rate. Excellency, look at me. Can I study and learn alone on the cold stone streets? Build places of learning that we may reap the rewards of wondrous new technologies. Excellency, my rough accounting shows that trade routes to other lands would best serve the Empire. All is well, Your Excellency. I am off to Greece by Abacus. Excellency, other nations have knowledge we need. Why not let our dull-witted swordsmen go forth and take it? Excellency, we are the most enlightened Empire in the world. I salute you. Most honorable leader, with all due respect, we cannot run an empire without coin. Raise the taxes or hire tax collectors swiftly. Just don't allow this weasel to touch the science rate, Excellency. You can do anything, but lay off my luxury rate, noble leader. Excellency, let us make currency instead of swords, for it is wealth that moves the world and profit that rules it. Most blessed leader, let us build marketplaces so that the peasants can barter for needed goods. Discover trade, Excellency, for we cannot barter with another nation when no means exists to reach them. My humble suggestion to your glorious person would be to build more caravans and trade with our unworthy neighbors. The empire runs well, Excellency, though additional taxes would hurt no one. We have riches beyond our wildest dreams, Your Excellency, and it is my pleasure to share in them. No! It's barracks we need, and quickly! No! The defense of the cities is our foremost concern! I concur, Excellency. I disagree, Excellency. Pay them no heed, Excellency. Excellency, I demand your attention! <laughs> I concur, Your Excellency. I disagree, Your Excellency. Pay them no heed, Excellency. A word, Your Excellency. Remember, all things have a price, Excellency. He speaks the truth, Excellency. I disagree, Excellency. Pay them no heed, Excellency. May we speak, Excellency? Ta! <laughs> you conniving sophist! You weak-minded eunuch! I concur, Excellency. I disagree, Excellency. Pay them no heed, Excellency. Noble leader, may we speak. You pig! Dog! T I concur, Your Majesty. No, Your Majesty. Pay them no heed, Your Majesty. A word, Your Majesty. I'm concerned, Majesty. May. Oh, yeah. Uh-huh. My talents go to waste, noble leader. Let us send forth our explorers to find other nations. Noble leader, the Empire would best be served by joining with another nation. 
There will be time enough to betray them later. My lord, there is an invention called writing, which allows the most marvelous communications with other lands. You would do well to discover it. Evil tidings, Lord, for other nations frown upon our treacherous ways. Let us make peace. Would you make peace with our enemies, Lord, or would you stick their head upon a pike? Perhaps I could persuade Your Excellency to build embassies so that we may traffic freely with other nations. My lord, other lands possess knowledge most useful. Let us trade technologies now and destroy them later. The gods adore you, noble leader, and distant lands favor our mighty empire. I don't mean to be stepping on your guilt of sandals, King, but the government will fall if we don't entertain the people. Science and taxes be damned, your nobleness. The people need luxuries to soothe their aching hearts. Excellency, we cannot sacrifice learning for luxuries. A noble leader, it takes coin, not clowns, to keep an empire afloat. A cloud darkens our land, noble leader, and the people need entertaining. Quickly. Wise men say that only fools run an empire without luxuries. King, no complaints. Noble leader. The heralds call out your name, glorious leader, and all is well with the people.